Erskine from Jerusalem. And Jerusalem means the city of peace, Yerushalayim, a city of completeness. And here in Dubai, I find something amazing. People come here to be friends, to invest in prosperity, to bring peace around themselves and to smile to each other. You see people here from different cultures, different backgrounds. Now, I myself was born in Moscow and I live in Israel for 45 years. I have traveled all, all over the world. And here in Dubai, I find something very special. This is a place to love, to cooperate and to come over and over again. It's a very special place. You know, there are so many dark, dark sides of news today around the world, very dark sides about politics. And here in Dubai, it's a kind of island of peace. Hey, good day. First of all, it's a pleasure to be here. I really enjoy it, and it's a great day. My name is Rafael, Rafael Jaron. I'm the CEO and founder of Govana. And uh, we have so far a real amazing day here in Dubai. We met so many people sharing our vision of planting new forests as an impact investment opportunity. So basically planting trees and getting a return on investment for our, for our investors. I mean, absolutely amazing. It's a right environment. It's perfectly talk about brainstorm and find solution to, to our program. That's great. Of course. So I am Marcus Sheff. I am the CEO of Impact SE, the Institute for Monitoring Peace and Cultural Tolerance in School Education. And what brings you here? Well, I am here because in many ways the United Arab Emirates is the crucible of peace and tolerance education in the Middle East. The UAE is really the pioneer of introducing standards of peace and tolerance into school education grades 1 to 12 and understanding how important it is that young people are imbued with ideas of respect for the other, for the individual other, peacemaking as a way to resolve conflict, that there is an association between tolerance and happiness and there is an association between tolerance and success and the UAE and of course um, his Excellency Mohammed Ben Ziad is the trailblazer. Hi, my name is Teresa DeMarco and I am the owner and founder of District by Boutique. It's a luxury e-commerce boutique. Uh, we've been in business for 15 years and we are a part of the Abrahamic Business Circle because it kind of encompasses everything that I personally believe in and of course uh, the cross-border uh, doing business, that kind of thing. We've been doing business internationally um, for 15 years, so all of it really matters and is important. And I'm also here because I have been looking for um, a partner now to help us uh, scale uh, in, a, in a very quick way since we've been doing it the slow way for 15 years. So we're at that point where we'd like to um, scale up and so these are the perfect place to find it. <laughs> well, thank you. My name is Joyce Pons and I'm the managing director of uh, Tenerus. And actually we are an innovative uh, company uh, between startup and scale up. We uh, print 3D boats. Um, and our first boat is in the water already uh, and we made us, uh, we printed a six and a half meter boat. Amazing. And what brings you here? What are you looking for? Uh, we are looking for investors um, and we were invited by the Abrahamic um, uh, Circle. Really pleased uh, that we do so. It's a very warm welcome we had over here um, and we had good conversations. So I'm pretty sure that um, this is the network where we were looking for. Uh, my name is Sultan. I'm from UAE actually. So uh, we are have a group can be like call it Anukhba groups. Uh, we are since 2000 established this is company. We are in different uh, uh, sections. So, so we are in oil trading, and then we are in real estate, and we are also in the solar, uh, like let's say in energy. Yes. So um, uh, we have already doing that uh, 
the solars in UAE and outside UAE. Like uh, we're starting doing the, uh, the project with the Costa Rica uh, countries right now. And we focused in Latin America. Sure, uh, pleasure to be here. My name is Martin Tekhurst. I'm a managing partner at Natural Ventures. We are a venture capital fund based in Abu Dhabi, investing in water and food security, which obviously is critical to national security here in the UAE, but also in the wider Gulf region. Um, we're here because Israel obviously is a, a, a hub, when it, hub of excellence when it comes to water and food security. So we look at Israeli companies on a very regular basis and are keen to maintain close ties with the ecosystem there. Yeah, my name is Dmitry Bridget. I'm a member of GCI Russia, uh, Junior Chamber International, uh, Vice President of International Relations. So my work is, my project is about consulting, consulting questions to, to come to Arab world and to see the Arab world because, you know, Arab world is, is growing, is uh, more invested and interested in Saudi Arabia and United Arab Emirates. And we know that this region is stable. There is no conflict. It's a peaceful region. So it's especially in Saudi Arabia. Don't forget that Saudi Arabia, now we have the Neon project. It's a project that uh, will make a future city and will bring many investors, will make uh, many uh, people from IT sector to Saudi Arabia and also like uh, United Emirates is also now a place where many people from different countries are coming to uh, to United Emirates to see the let's say the the culture the Arab culture the technologies etc that is in United Emirates. Thank you very much. Hi everyone, I'm Cristina Guerrero. I'm the head of marketing uh, for Cuareros uh, Marketing Accelerator. We are a full service social media solution that help people to build their online reputation, their, to show their skills and to, be, to get more clients on social media. And we also help companies to achieve that. Um, we, we work with the LinkedIn algorithm to boost performance and we have a good community of, of liking and sharing to increase the, the visibility online. And I'm very happy to be here at the Abrahamic Business Circle. It's been an amazing event where we are getting new people, new connections, learning for other people. So it's been a, an excellent uh, idea, an excellent day. Thank you very much. Good to see you again. I am uh, Ralph Shamas. I was here in December, the first time, and I'm happy to be invited again. Um, I represent T-Rox. Um, it's a digital asset boutique. Actually, I could say one of the first in the world that is doing what we are doing, we trade digital assets, we select the top 50 worldwide, which are most liquid and, and good quality, and we trade them in our portfolio. And we have two products, one small one, which is for retail clients, that's been going on for the past six years, and has accumulated more than 65 million in the meantime, and we created a new product, which is a fund for big investors, which has specific requirements for big investors. And, and uh, that is available as a fund investment for everybody who likes. And we have, as a result, since six years, now it is 30% per annum. When I was here in December, it was 25. And then the last three months, we added another 25%. So this is what we do. Oh, uh, hello. Uh, my name is Perez Rule. I'm a partner at Sanson Group Limited. We are a capital raising firm based in the Turks and Caicos Islands, so that's in the Caribbean. I'm originally from the Bahamas. Uh, I was invited to this event by Fatima and Marika, um, lovely representatives of the Abrahamic Business Circle. Um, we took the opportunity by accepting the invite just to network with like-minded uh, individuals as well as to be introduced to new capital sources. So my firm principally raises capital for clients in the real estate and hospitality sector. Um, so it was amazing getting the opportunity to meet again with investors as well as developers who are in this space and others looking to network outside of the real estate uh, sector. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, you know, uh, my name is Sandeep Kumar. I'm an uh, associate tax partner with one of the boutique firms here in the UAE, Dhruva Consultants. Uh, I am a professional who specializes in corporate and inter international taxation, and I've been uh, practicing the tax law since the last 14 years. Uh, having worked with all the big four accounting firms, uh, I was given an opportunity today to give a brief overview on how the taxes operate in the GCC region particularly UAE, where the tax law is you know, evolving at a rapid pace. And I think that was the most important point for me being here today, because the businesses 
of course, the Abrahamic, you know, Abrahamic business circle, they invited us. And a lot of people have curiosity around as to how these taxes will come into play, what sort of preparation is needed. And this is where my firm, you know, comes into play. We help businesses in making sure they, they get prepared for this new regime. And uh, an advisory firm like ours, since we have done this kind of a work in and out in the other jurisdictions, having this, you know, getting this implemented in the UAE is, is one thing which we are excited about. So the idea here was to meet as many people, see, you know, how we can help them, at least create an awareness for them so that they don't caught, get caught on the wrong foot eventually when they're undertaking a business in the jurisdiction like UAE. Yeah, well, I'm uh, Maximiliano. Uh, I'm the CEO of Canal Market International which is founded by my son, uh, Josue Daniel Nicolás, and I'm just giving him some support as far as uh, uh, growing the business. So I'm here in, uh, in this uh, marvelous uh, meeting uh, to expand the connection, expand the scope of investment, expand also the scope of our relationship and uh, to bring new opportunities to the table. So, so far, this has been a wonderful time uh, here in the Abraham uh, Business Circle, uh, we'll be able to meet uh, new investors from around the world and also not only meet investors from around the world, but also uh, get some new connections that will uh, lead us uh, to start uh, new entrepreneurship and uh, new business. Hello, how are you? I am Sergio, Sergio Gisbert. I am the founder of Sigeneri. Uh, Sigeneri was born in 2010, but I come from experience in England of eight years. So I am here in this fantastic uh, venue to make connections, good friendship for business, and challenging myself to use in English because it's not my, my first tongue. So I am looking forward to, to, to get traction, to get good relations and generate opportunities. Hi, my name is Molloy and uh, I'm from IBIG. We are an investment business group uh, from Denmark and we invest in uh, sustainable businesses across globe and uh, in the primary domain of uh, consumer durables and tech. And uh, apart from that, uh, we have our own uh, ventures and I work as a chief operating officer for a sustainable woman business, uh, which the name of the brand is One People.